Hello my dear students. Today we will learn the definitions of adjacent angles and linear pair of angles with figure. So number one adjacent angles. When two angles are said to be adjacent angles, listen carefully. Two angles are said to be adjacent angles if they have point one a common vertex point two a common arm point three two non common arms look at the figure here a o c and b o c are two angles they have the common vertex o this vertex o this one we can say common vertex common common vertex o and they have a common arm oc and they have two non common arms oa and ob so we can say aoc and boc are two non common sorry are two adjacent angles and if you look it carefully these two non common arms they are from the common arm they are on opposite side see oa is where from oc it is down and this ob is where from oc it is where up okay so now we can write here like this adjacent angles we can write two angles two angles are said to be said to be adjacent angles adjacent angles if they have they have a number one point common arm sorry common what is vertex number 2 they have a common common arm this oc common arm we can write oc okay we will write it okay oc and number 3 this two non common arms see here ob and O A. So two non common arms, non common arms on opposite side of opposite side of common arm. Okay, this OA and OC they are on opposite side of the common arm. So we can explain like this in the figure. In figure AOC angle AOC and angle BOC are adjacent angles. Are adjacent angles why as number one they have a common what is common vertex look here the common vertex is what o can write here o in bracket point two they have a common what is arm what is the name OC in the figure you see OC and point 3 two non common arms two non common arms OA and OB OA and 
OB which are opposite side from the common arm okay so that is about the adjacent angles now coming to the point for linear pair angles or linear pair of angles so this linear pair of angles it comes from adjacent angles look here in the figure of adjacent angle C the two non-common arms which are OA and OB if we see this OA and OB carefully we see this OA and OB they do not form opposite rays they do not form opposite rays this OA is where down of OC and OB is where up of OC okay but they are not forming the opposite rays so if you look this figure here figure 2 look here there are two angles in this figure also AOC and BOC and they have the common vertex O they have the common arm OC and they have two non-common arms what OA and OB but if we look here these two non-common arms OA and OB they are where in they are forming what opposite rays opposite this OA is where going right side and OB is coming where left hand side and they form a straight line AOB so when these two non-common arms form a straight line then these two angles we call linear pair of angles and in such cases the sum of these two angles AOC and BOC is equal to 180 degree so we can say here linear pair angles two angles two angles two angles are said to be said to be two right here two adjacent angles okay two adjacent angles two adjacent angles are said to be linear pair of angles are said to be linear pair angles if their non-common arms non-common non-common arms form two opposite rays two opposite two opposite rays see here this OA and OB they are forming two opposite rays and we can explain in figure in figure angle AOC can mark here angle AOC and angle BOC this is angle AOC this is angle BOC okay so angle AOC and angle BOC form a linear pair form a linear pair as this OA and OB as the opposite rays as as we can write OA and OB form two opposite rays two opposite rays that is we have to remember when they form two opposite rays OA and OB so they will form a straight line AOB so we can see that is AOB is a AOB is a straight line is a straight line and we have to remember straight line and sum of two linear pair of angle is 180 degree so 
therefore here it will be angle AOC plus angle this is AOC plus angle BOC is equal to 180 degree so we have to remember when two angles form a linear pair their sum is what 180 degree okay thank you my dear students